For the chords to la bas string, I recommend keeping it simple. Let's just do one bow per beat, which allows the harmony and the melody both to shine through. It's going to look like this. Each bar is going to get a down bow and an up bow. So your first bar is going to go G, G, then your second bar goes D, G, then your third bar goes D, D, and your fourth bar, G, G. Let's just try that much. One, two, here we go. This time it's our turn not to go too fast. The harmony and the melody have a lot more going on than the chords do, and it's up to us not to rush. Let's try it again. One, two, here we go. All right, let's take a look at the second line. We're going to go G, G, D, G, just like we did on the first line. Now we have to get our C ready because we're going to go C, G, D, G. Let's take a look at the second half of the second line. It starts on your C chord, so find your C. This is bar seven. We're going to go C, G, D, G. One, two, here we go. Let's do it once more. Bar seven. One, two, C chord, go. Okay, let's try the whole A part. Remember, don't go too fast. One, two, A part chords. At that speed, the tune goes this fast. Let's take a look at the B part chords. You'll notice something new here. We have an F chord. We're going to use our F natural to play this. Please don't play your F sharp. Make sure it's really low, an F natural. Let's give it a try. We're going to do two bows of G and two bows of F. Let's do just that much in freeze. One, two, B part chords. All right, let's try it again. One, two, here we go. Continuing on, we're going to go G, G, D, G. One, two, ready, go. You may notice that the chords and the harmony happen at different times. This will create a cool interlocking effect as one section plays and then another section plays. Let's give the chords for the B part one more try. G, ready, here we go. F, back to G, 